Al, yeah. when did you first think of taking on this crazy journey? We went for a walk really when, when Richard came back from Australia with his family to live over here again. We uh, just went for a day walk on Canal, went across to Bingley and come back again. And, uh, and you it was said, one of those things that was really nice. And you said, let's do the whole thing? Just said, let's do the whole thing. You know, why don't we do it for rest this year, next year? I said, actually. And he was like, yeah. And here we are, year after, getting and ready the, for it. And the whole family are involved in doing the little bits, they are. organising. Especially um, Mrs. Dickinson. Yeah, she's she's been absolute star, really, hasn't she? She's, uh, she's just taken on organising pretty much the whole thing. Um, she's just been really, really supportive. Everything uh, that she can get involved in, she's getting involved in. She's got a say in everything. She just wants to, to know what everybody's doing, and she's on top of it, which is absolutely great. We need somebody to sort of coordinate it, so perfect. And uh, the holders as well, getting yeah. sponsors, and uh, Rach. Rach has been amazing, and the holders have been great too. I mean, you know, uh, Wendy and Kev, they've got sponsor sheets going out on the players. They've got um, sponsor sheet up at Asda where Kev works. Um, Rach, oh, what can I say? Everything, absolutely brilliant. She's got, uh, she's designed the posters. But she did one, it looked great. And then she come back with a, with, with a beefed up version. It was just absolutely amazing. Yeah, I, I've seen it. I think that's gonna uh, be really, really beneficial. Yeah, I do. It's so catchy. I mean, not, that poster's gonna be next to all the collection pots on uh, a couple of pub bars and, and in Andy's Butchers down in Silsen. So we're catching local community as well. Perfect. And what do your other daughters think of this? Oh, they're, they're really happy actually. What, you know, one of them wanted to do it with me, but it's just so much, and during school time as well, you know, it's not an option. So um, that's not going to be possible. It would have been a lot of training as well. I just don't think they could have fit it in. Um, three of them are going through the GCSEs right now. It's too much to do. Um, but they're still involved. Um, they're supporting us more than anything, you know. That, they're even looking after the sister a bit, a little bit more, which is really, really nice. Um, but come the Halifax game down at Keithley, um, they're going to be going around with our T-shirts on that we're getting designed right now, um, and they're going to be going around with collection pots, um, getting a bucket collection together. Yeah, it's, good. it's good that everyone's involved. Um, what, how does it affect you? Yeah. The whole family, when you've got a, uh, a a daughter with Rex, what sort of impact does it have on everybody else? Um, I suppose it depends on what, what stage your daughter with Rex is at, if you will. Um, it, it's difficult. Um, Estelle doesn't like environments where there's a lot of people sometimes. She doesn't like, uh, you know, if we go out in the car, if we go to a car park, multi-story car park, or, or even one in the open in the minute, she just freezes. You know, trying to get her in and out of the car is difficult. So, and then you can get her out of the car, put her in a push chair, set off, and she's not happy. It's not where she wants to be, not what she wants to do. So, you know, she, she, she gets upset, and it's time to go home within 20 minutes. You know, rush around, get what you want, go. It's not easy. One person we have... Or organisation we have forgotten to mention. Yeah. Giving us a lift down there. The Cougars. Cougars. Fantastic. Yeah. Fantastic. That that club means um, a lot to me. Um, I used to watch them back in Cougar Mania days, and you know the, the buzz that was going on in the town then was something amazing. And it's not quite got there yet, but it's the best team we've had since that era. And JD's done a fab job, so. Credit to him, um, Angela, being her usual organising self. Got in touch with uh, Gary Fawcett the other day and asked him about, you know, you think you could uh, sort the Cougar bus out to drop us lads off in Liverpool on the day? Yeah. Um, he agreed to that. I think at that point she sort of mentioned the fact we might need a driver and it's five o'clock in the morning, but he didn't seem phased. <laughs> I think he wants to support us lads. Um, yeah. And that's great. That's great to spot us on the cause. Yeah. How terrified are you of that um, day when it comes? Because I am. <laughs> um, 
Yeah, <laughs> yeah, very. Um, let's just get the training in. Like, that's what it is, get the stamina built up. It's going to be difficult. I've, I don't know if I really know what I've let myself in for, but one thing for sure is failure's not an option. No. And it scares me to death, but we can't fail. We can't. No. Every day, people are just putting a little bit more donations our way. Um, just one donation coming in a day just means so much. Doesn't matter, fiver, three pound, anything. The price just means a, so much. The price of a pint. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. If anyone fancies joining you for a bit of a walk, is how does uh, that grab you? That is a good idea. Um, I think those lads are going to need all the support we can get. Um, and, and people just tagging along for a few mile here and a few mile there. Perfect. Especially on the last day when, we, yeah. when we're going from Skipton to Leeds, which is a, a 28 mile stretch. But some people might want to do Skipton to Keefley or Keefley to Shipley or Shipley to Leeds. Absolute, they, absolutely. they can help carry me if uh, nothing else. <laughs> absolutely. It's, it's, it's a long old haul, isn't it? Yeah. And the reality is that's probably the least that we're going to have to walk on, on our four days in, in one day, you know. But it might be our easiest day. It might be our easiest day, it might be our hardest day. Um, it's going to be a very challenging day. Um, but if, if anyone wants to tag along for a few miles, more than appreciate it, appreciated, without a doubt. Yeah. Well, I think we better catch up, don't you? Yeah. A, a, a what? <laughs> <laughs>